In this tutorial, let's see what is isomorphism of a graph. To be clear, isomorphism means similar. In normal words, we can say they two are isomorphic. Hence, they both are similar. They both are same. Okay. Let us go through it a bit depth. Two graphs are said to be isomorphic if they are perhaps the same graphs just drawn differently. With different names that is they have identical behavior of all the properties are followed. The number of vertices are equal, the number of edges are equal, degree of each node is similar in both the graphs. The cycle lengths of them are also similar. Let us take an example of this. This could be one of the best example for this. So, this is something like a cuboid. This is also a cuboid. This is also a cuboid. But these both are isomorphic. Whereas, if you if some if they give some diagram and they ask you to prove it, so initially take this as v1, v2, v3, v4, v5, v6, v7, v8. It's all up to you, and just write down the degree at each. Degree is nothing but the number of edges that passes through that vertex. V1, there are 3. V2, 3. V3, 3. V4, 3. V5, 3. V6, 3. V7, 3. V8, also 3. Even though here also, we are having for V1, 3. V2, V3. All are similar. Whereas, whenever you want to... Okay. For the first case, all the vertices are same. All the degrees are same. So, now, let's come to edges. Here we are having V1 to V2. Here we are not having V1 to V2. Okay, we, we are having V1 to V2. V1 to V5 we are having. V1 to V5 we are having. V1 to V4 we are having. Yes, it is isomorphic. Uh, everything is similar. If you want, you can check step by step. V, V1 is done. V2 to V1. V2 to V1. V2 to V3. V2 to V3. V2 to V6. V2 to V6. Yes. Next, V3, V3, uh, V3 to V7, V3 to V4, V4, V3 to, V3 to, V2, yep. Next, V4, V4 to V8, V4 to V1, V4 to V3. Yes, this is an isomorphic graph. As the number of edges are same and they map from same vertices. Hence, the following two are isomorphic. Thanks for watching the video guys. Thanks.